Jason Myers to kick off for Seattle. Here's the kicker, Jason Myers, to get this one started. And off we go from Seattle. Fielded near the back of the end zone. And this will go as a touchback, and they will begin things at the 25. time with Clyde Edwards Alaire and not a lot of daylight not really any daylight inside as he's going to be stopped right at the line of scrimmage brings up second down play. second and 10 at the 25 yard line now the first carry for Le'Veon Bell and he's taken down but able to slip across the 35 so from the 36 now first and 10 at the 36 yard line and they'll keep it on the ground with Bell. And very little room to maneuver. He'll get this down to about the 39. You give him three on first down. It'll set up a second and seven. Brings up second and seven. Yellow, yellow. On the line, right? Check, 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 check. They'll run. It's Edwards Alaire. Good work to pick up seven yards there. That gets him into a third and one situation. A seven yard gain on the play. Edwards Alaire, they'll try to run for it. He's got the first down and more inside the 40. And he's going to take this all the way down to the Seahawks 23 yard line. Well, they only needed a small gain on third down. They end up getting over 30 yards. First down, Chiefs. They'll run here with Edwards Alaire. He is taken down at the 21 after a short gain of two. The last run good for two. Here's second and eight. Two yards on the pickup. It's second and eight at the 21-yard line. Now Edwards Alaire. And he stopped immediately there. The ball carrier. All right, quick observation, Brandon, because early on in this game, I'm seeing linebackers putting up their noses close to the line of scrimmage. And my guess is the wheels are turning on that other sideline. As a play caller, you're filing that away right now, aren't you? Yeah, you're trying to find that opportunity later on when you can play action them or stick something to them between the second and the third level. Here comes the seventh play in this opening drive. They've moved it well, but here's third down. Now a carry for Edwards Hilaire. And they're going to get him down well short of the first as he can only get this to about the 19. Only a yard of the pickup there, and it's going to leave him with a fourth down. Fourth down. So on fourth down, Mahomes off. Harrison Butker on for the Chiefs field goal. From the left hash, it's a 36-yard attempt. Butker's kick here is good. And the Chiefs are out to a 3-0 lead. So a nice drive on the road. You come in, you take the ball down, you get three points. Yeah, points are a must on an opening drive, right? So they moved it down efficiently, got it done. I think that bodes well for their chances moving forward in this one. Five yard line. The Seahawks take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. Wilson and the Seahawks take over now, first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. Out of the gun, he'll throw. And he's taken down, a Chiefs sack. Frank Clark fighting his way home to get the sack. Back at the 18-yard line. Throwing on second and long. Wilson, and this a quick slant to lock it. And up to the 35 before they're able to knock him down. It's a pickup of 17 and a first down. From the gun, Wilson. Left side complete to Lockett. He'll take this to the other side of midfield before going out of bounds. It's another first down as they look his way again, this time 19 yards. First down. First and 10 at the operating from the gun. Wilson. In a double coverage and it's intercepted. Picked off at the 39. There he goes, right side. I'm gonna show you that. And he will take this one home. It's a touchdown. 
So a pick six there out of the nickel package. They went with five DBs. Almost becoming the base package in the NFL is the nickel. Hard to throw against. That was demonstrated one more time. A pick six going the other way. Harrison Butker is on for the extra point. It's up and good, and that'll increase their lead to 10 zip. Makes the score Chiefs 10, Seahawks nothing. Harrison Butker. So they'll get another shot on offense following that pick six, and now the kick is away. This taken in about four yards deep. And this will come out to the 25 as Reed opts for the touchback. 25 yard line. Coming to the line here to begin their next drive, the Seahawks offense. And following the pick six, and they have decent field position in throwing that pick six. We'll see how they attack this drive. And I think all you say to your guy is, listen, let's just take care of the football a little bit better. Make some better decisions on this drive, and they'll probably help him a little bit with maybe some really high percentage throws early to let him get settled back yeah, in. But they told him, they told us, they've got confidence. That, that's not a problem. Yeah, not a problem at all. They just want to make sure they get things settled down a little bit for their offense and give their defense a little bit of a chance to rest. On first down, Wilson. Hit as he throws there, incomplete. Well, we always talk about how you've got to be quick when you go through your progressions, and here's another prime example. Trying to look downfield, he was standing in the pocket, but just couldn't find anyone open, did he? No, not enough time. They hit him and forced that incompletion. Wilson on target there to Moore, and he'll be brought down with a first down as the tackle's made at the Chiefs' 26. A really nice gain of 25 yards. This is the Oklahoma State alum, Chris Carson. It's a six-yard pickup, and it gets him to second and four. The 19-yard line. It's a pickup of six. Brings up second and four. They run it with Carson. And on this one, he'll get to the 15, right at the 15-yard line. Four yards, the pickup, first down. It's nice every now and then in this game not to see people overthink it. Just hand it to the old reliable guy. Let him pick up the first down. Wilson after the play fake to Carson. And he finds Lockett in the end zone. Touchdown, Seattle. Touchdown, Tyler Lockett. There to make the grab. And the Seahawks able to make this a close game again. And again, it's no good. A few boo birds coming out as he's missed his second extra point here in the first half. So with the missed PAT in his rearview mirror, he goes back out to kick this one off. And this carries into the end zone. And the decision to come out of the end zone is going to cost him five yards as he's taken down right at the 20. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. And they split the uprights last time for three. They've got the lead. They're not going to play this conservative. They're, they're not hoping for another field goal. They're hoping for a touchdown. I'm with you on that one. I like where your head is. I like the way you're thinking because you're exactly right. Trying to sit on a lead and play that way, that doesn't work too well for most teams. Run your offense. Run what you do best. Exactly. Put it all the way down and try to increase your lead in a big way. And the best way to do it, touchdowns. Two yards the loss, and now third and 12. And it's third down. Working from the gun, Mahomes. Looking left side, and he's got a man. That's Bell. And this effort won't be enough as they rally up to stop him a couple of yards short. A gain of nine, not enough, and it's fourth down. Fourth down. They do go for it. It's Mahomes. It's complete. Swings it out to his running back. 
And he's able to get this one up to his 30 before he's out of bounds. Boy, a curious decision to go for it. Doesn't pan out. And the Seahawks, they'll get the football back in outstanding field position. On first and 10, it's Wilson buying time to his left. And he's going to keep it here. And they'll have it in the red zone before he crosses over out of bounds. Good coverage downfield led to him taking off, picking up the first down on a 13-yard run. The 18-yard line. A reminder that when halftime rolls around, Jonathan Coachman will have all the highlights and analysis of this first half of play from our studios in Orlando. And it's incomplete. Boy, he doesn't drop many like that one. Second down. And to put it mildly, this is a tough spot defensively. They have to come right back out and defend their red zone. But how about that good first step towards forcing them to settle for at least three points? I think they're also thinking bigger right now. Imagine being able to stop them totally and change the momentum. They do get a couple, but they'll be left staring at a third and eight coming up. The ball popped in the air and intercepted. Picked off inside the 10. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. Charles, not only is that an interception, it's one when you were really knocking on the door for a touchdown inside the red zone. You're actually thinking points. No matter what, at worst, you're thinking kicking a field goal and getting three. We might look back on this in the second half and say, you remember when they didn't get points on that drive? This could cost them. A solid run on first down. Gain of seven. Leaves him with a second and three. Gets it to Hill. It's a jet sweep. And he's able to get up here to the 26. That one, a first down pickup of eight. Jamal Adams there on the tackle. Here's Edwards Hilaire. And he takes this up to the 40-yard line before being corralled. That goes for a Chiefs first down, 14 yards. Bobby Wagner. A gain of 14. And the first down, Chiefs. Now they'll throw with Mahomes. Complete the tight end, Kelsey. And he takes this one down almost all the way to the 30. The Chiefs now going to use the first of their timeouts as they'll stop the clock with 24 seconds to go in this first half. A handoff as they run the counter play. And he'll get this down to about the 30, 31 yard line. Now another timeout called for by the offense as the clock will stop with 20 seconds to go in the first half. The run only got a yard. Here's second and nine. They go play action. Now Mahomes sliding out of the pocket. And that is caught. Touchdown, Kansas City. Tyreek Hill. Tyreek Hill. As the first half is winding down. And the Chiefs are able to grow their lead. And that's certainly an important score right there because they gave themselves a two-score cushion heading towards halftime. Now you got to force the other team out of their comfort zone, and it changes the way you approach the second half as well. How you want to do things on offense, and your defense feels much better too, having that lead. And no return on this one as the fair catch is signaled for and taken. The Seahawks take over first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. Here's the Seattle offense ready to get this drive underway. And they had a nice little drive going last time. 
Threw the interception in the red zone. Costly. Bad enough to throw it anywhere, but that drive. And the Chiefs are going to get him. Chris Jones coming right up the gut. Gets in there for a loss of nine. Now a timeout taken. Perhaps a chance for one more quick play and then another timeout if they hurry. We'll see. Throwing on second and long. Wilson. And that is incomplete. Two seconds left on the clock. Incomplete. And we're going to get a timeout. With two seconds remaining in the second quarter. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. 56. Mike, 56, right there, right there, 56. Go, go, go. Gotta go, in and out, let's go. Quick, quick, cut, cut. Watch the whip. Final play of the half, it's Wilson. Got a man, and he hits him in stride. And he'll get it up to the 33-yard line. And that'll do it for the end of the second quarter. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. All right, Coach, thank you, and we welcome everyone back for quarter number three. The Seahawks trailing, but they will have possession first here as we resume action in the third quarter. Fielded near the back of the end zone. to the line here to begin their next drive the Seahawks offense they'll throw on first down with Wilson oh the ball comes out on the hit but they'll say it's incomplete maybe a little frustration starting to creep in the offensive line hasn't done a great job of protecting him in this game and there he was hit again as he threw it yeah another time on his backside probably starting to get a little frustrated gotta keep his composure can't let the defense know that they're getting to him off the play fake here's Wilson Wilson hit it's loose it's out fumble fortunate to get that football back because trailing here in the second half last thing they needed was to lose the possession and the word I think of here is opportunity because it could have been lost there their chance to score points but the opportunity for the defense was to go ahead and really close this game down if they were able to get possession Play action. It's Wilson. He's going to look deep for more. And that is incomplete. Oh, he had a defender right there with him to force that to the ground. And fourth down now coming up. That's an excellent job right there on third down. Like any defense, you never want to let them get anything started. And that would have been a first down. Instead, you saw the contact on time, no penalty. And before this drive could get wings, it's fourth down. Michael Dixon as the drive goes backwards, so he's on to punt it away. And they'll let this one go right on the outskirts of the 10. They'll down it at the 11 yard line. At their own 11 yard line. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. They were able to get the ball back here, didn't surrender any points. Now they'll look to add to that lead. Now how about the boost the defense gave them? Going right out on the field, shutting them down, not giving up any points, and turning the ball back over. They want to do their part now and show them a little respect and some gratitude by scoring some points. And to get a little more cushion, right back to Edwards Alaire on first down. And they're going to get this beyond the 40 before he's taken down. That burst good for 20 and a first down. It's a gain of 20 and a first down, Chiefs. 
Mahomes going to pull it out and keep it himself. And this one's going to go the wrong way. Losing yardage back at the 42. He'll lose a yard there, and it's second and 11. Brings up second and 11 at the 42-yard line. On second down, a run with Edwards Alaire. And the play goes nowhere. Losing yardage back near the 40 at the 39. That's a big loss of three, and it brings up third down. Back at the 39 yard line. They fake the give. Now Mahomes. And they're going deep for Hill. That's caught inside the 20. And all the way in for a Kansas City touchdown. Tyreek Hill. Tyreek Hill. Two catches, two touchdowns here so far. And the Chiefs are able to extend their lead. Partner, they had a good lead as they went in at the half. And they came out here in the second half and found a way to extend it. I love their consistency. Don't worry about what they said at halftime. This seemed like a team that was ready to play 60 minutes. And while this game is far from over, I love their approach. After the roughing penalty on the PAT, they'll kick off from 15 yards further upfield. And that'll carry over the back line of the end zone for a touchback. At their own 25-yard line. Wilson and the Seahawks take over now, first and 10 at their 25-yard line. From the shotgun, Wilson. And Wilson's going to be intercepted a third time. Picked off here by Anthony Hitchens. And that's a great example of ball skills right there, partner. You and I do a lot of games, and I can't tell you how many guys look to run with the football before they've intercepted it. So that's a nice job of focusing on the task at hand and coming away with the interception. They run the counter now on first down. And he is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. Two yards the loss, second and 12. Brings up second and 12 on the Seahawks' 35-yard line. And he fires one that's intercepted. Picked up by D.J. Reed. 30, the 20. And he will take this one home. It's a touchdown. I think this is where you have to have the term situational football in your head because this game is pretty much in the palm of your hand and the one thing you can't afford to do, turn the ball over. Now you've given the patient a little bit of a heartbeat, haven't you? And now they're feeling it and they're back in this game. Yeah, still a little bit of a lead, but that makes things more interesting. We're still just in the third quarter here. And he's going to get in for the two points, and that'll make this a ten-point game. And there's a quick momentum swing. INT return for a pick six, and then the two-point conversion good. And even if you're keeping your wits about you, you're thinking to yourself, okay, extra point block team going into the game now. All of a sudden, you're hearing defense. Everyone's scrambling for their helmets and throwing down their cups of water. That's a great position for them to be in, trying to score against that team. A little bit disjointed. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. And last time, decent field position through the pick six. Obviously costly. But they can't afford to just bunker in now. All right, they, good field position means go ahead and attack on offense. Try and press the advantage a little bit. They just have to be better with the football on this possession. So the last one didn't bother you too much last time? No, because this is exactly what you're supposed to do. You can't have good field position and not try to take advantage of it. Sometimes the defense makes a good play, too. They had three yards on first down, just one yard there. On third down, here's Edwards Alaire. He's got a first down and then some at midfield. The 30! And all the way in for...